Hi everyone. So in this video, I got myself a coffee and I want to test the CXD WPL D12 K truck. Uh, it's a 160 scale version. I've seen lots of videos on YouTube about it. I do not really know what the fuss is about, but it seems to be very popular and I want to find out why. So have fun. And here it is. Let's have a look inside. Uh, oh whoops. As usual we will have a look at the car later. The remote is small and fits well in my hand. We have fully proportional throttle and steering and it makes well for one-handed driving. Steering trim and a button to change the speed and here we have some bits and pieces. USB charger, some parts have to be still attached though, screwdriver, stickers but they're not very well made you have to cut them by hand to make them fit. Instructions. The car itself is fitted with friction dampers. Well, it looks actually quite cool with the RCA WD stickers. In the back you can see the spare tire. The tires themselves are made of very hard rubber. But since you can get those cars for about 30 euros, I will not complain too much. It's got working headlights. It's a 160 scale, but it feels smaller. Here it is next to my 300 milliliter coffee cup. Remote on, car on, and go. It drives better than I expected and it's also faster than I expected. Whoops. Oh. It's rear wheel drive. The springs are okay, I guess. It is not a crawler, that's for sure. Delivering coffee. Oh, oh no. no. But seen as a toy, it is actually quite cool. It's fun to goof around with it and check out this turning circle. Out of the box it doesn't seem like much, but for 30 euros there's some fun to be had with it. I think that they're mostly popular because of the potential that they're bringing. I imagine slapping the body on a crawler chassis would be quite cool or making it a drift car. First to second graders might also have their fun with it. What do you think about this little truck? If you liked the video please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.